Hey everybody, today I wanted to show you a couple of quick Apple scripts that will send iMessages or SMS messages to um, your phone numbers, to friends, um, or you can use an iMessage or messages nowadays email address um, in the iMessage script. Okay, so here it is. I'm gonna go look at uh, iMessage. This is the yes, this is the iMessage. I have the five 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 here because I don't um, want to show any of my contact phone numbers but you would simply replace the fives with your uh, friend that has messages connected to their phone put their phone number in there and they will receive whatever message you put after the send command and remember you have to have the end parameter here which is to iMessage Buddy. iMessage Buddy is a holdout from the old um, iMessage uh, application because they were known as buddies instead of contacts but as you all know Apple Script hasn't changed much so it still uses the same old syntax so with the scripting to iMessage you can use either a phone number connected to iMessage or the email address that's connected to it now here is the other one where did it go Oh, it didn't open, I guess. Send to iMessage, and then here's the send to SMS. Yes, here it is. Okay. It's the, almost the same command, but it's a little bit simpler to send to SMS phone numbers. So, send hello after the send command this is the the message that's sending it's hello this is just a test of automation to again buddy is still there but the service is SMS instead of iMessage right here or iMessage service is or instead of SMS depending on which uh, script you're going to use now Here's the key. You can use um, Keyboard Maestro as a trigger. So I'm going to launch Keyboard Maestro here. Now we're going to go uh, to New, oops, new um, Macro. I'm going to call it iMessage. And then uh, keep it like this. That's a trigger that's going to be by a hotkey. I want to say, I don't know which, but let's call it Command uh, Caps Lock M. Let me see if I have something here. And then we're going to do a Apple script uh, action. So execute and then here is Apple script
And then, so there's your um, Apple script in that dialog box, and now you can just copy this, or you can insert a file. It doesn't matter which. For now, I'm going to copy this. Paste it in here. And remember, you have to change this to the phone number you're going to send. And from here, you can um, just execute the script and see what happens. I'm going to see if this compiles. So uh, let's see what do I do to try to compile it. Uh, try this action. Oh, can't get the ID because that phone number is not a um, is not a uh, legitimate phone number, and it's not an iMessage phone number. But this script will run, and the same thing for. this script here. This will run uh, an SMS text message from your phone using your Mac to uh, whoever you send the message to. So again, use these scripts carefully. With a lot of power comes a lot of responsibility. Nah, that's just a joke guys. Anyway, that's all I have for you today. Um, please like, subscribe, and comment in the uh, comments below to let me know what happened. Did it execute well? Did it not for you? Um, again, Apple Script may have changed in um, more up-to-date OS's. I'm on High Sierra right now. Uh, obviously there's all the way to Big Sur now. But, um, or Catalina I think is the public OS right now. Um, so let me know in the comments below if this worked for you. Or you had to uh, look up another script to get this to work. Alright. Thanks guys. I'll see you in the next video.